As is a tradition for over 20 years for me, I analyzed Super Bowl commercials this year for content and likability. For Super Bowl 55, I was joined by my colleague, Ron Sicker, and a few marketing students via Zoom. The commercials this year had an equal dose of humor and emotional appeal, and at least one third of the brands we saw made their debut in the Super Bowl, and their creativity was impressive for being first timers. Based on my previous findings, ad likability of Super Bowl commercials is typically driven by humor, celebrities, kids, animals, to mention a few of the factors. It is the clever combination of these ingredients that makes a Super Bowl commercial likable and popular and the subject of water cooler talk the next day. Some of my favorite commercials had humor and celebrities mixed well together. I was also really touched by the messaging of emotional commercials tugging at my heartstrings this year. From a lighthearted perspective, the Alexa commercial when Michael B. Jordan from Black Panther takes the body of Alexa was one of my favorites. I also liked um, the Cheetos Pop Crunch with Mila Kunis and uh, Ashton Kutcher with Shaggy. It was pretty clever, funny, and celebrity laden. The commercial for Tide with the, the Jason Alexander hoodie was very clever and creative with the, the hoodie changing expressions um, and funny and got the message through for the product as well. The M&Ms come together commercial, a gift to be given as an apology um, with Dan Levy from Schitt's Creek was uh, also pretty entertaining. From an emotional perspective, I like the Toyota commercial with the Paralympian um, Jessica Long story of her adoption from Siberia and her life story, a message also conveying the company's commitment and values and their commitment to the Olympics. I also think the Indeed commercial for job seekers hit the spot addressing something that we can relate to during the pandemic. And the Jeep commercial with Bruce Springsteen was absolutely powerful and a win. Other commercials that are worth a mention um, are the um, Can't Blame the Lag for Verizon with Samuel L. Jackson um, calling out Juju Schuster Smith of the Pittsburgh Steelers um, from above uh, was uh, pretty funny and entertaining and got the message through. And um, interestingly, the Rocket Mortgage commercial with um, Tracy Morgan, Certain is Better, uh, was um, clever, conveyed the message, and funny. The Bud Light um, um, Legends commercial um, also hit on humor and celebrities and a little bit of nostalgia, and that was interesting. I also liked the nostalgic uh, Wayne's World commercial from Uber Eats. That was pretty nice. So those are some of um, my picks for this year's uh, Super Bowl commercials. Overall, the message uh, was slightly different in this year's uh, ad ball. <laughs> the game was also slightly different. There was a lot more outdoors portrayed and less crowds portrayed in commercials, but there was no shortage of um, creative uh, considering the dire circumstances under which these companies had to produce their commercials this past year. So kudos to all the newcomers and their creatives um, that um, brought all the commercials and the ad bowl together for us in Super Bowl 55.